rarely go out and see somebody in the This is not what I usually use, but I just grabbed it. This is the body shot. You can't even see it. The body shot vitamin E nourishing body butter, which I really do like. But anyway, so today is Tuesday, June the 1st. And if you haven't already realized, I'm on my way to the gym. I have challenged myself for the month of June to work out every single day. And I have challenged myself to other things also, but I'm going to just, you know, keep those things to myself um i really wanted june to be a month of the word the, the word of the month for june to for me is discipline um it's something that i'm really trying to work on being disciplined because so many times i say that i'm gonna do this that this and that and i don't do it um i think one thing you know that i need to work on on my behalf is to not like to set realistic goals when it comes to things that I'm going to do. And it's so crazy because I bought me a treadmill, right? And the treadmill I bought, it comes with iFit, which if you don't know what that is, it's like it's like a a system where you like you have trainers, you have all different type of workouts that you can use and they actually have trainers. And like, so you can like on this day, I think I was running in Portugal and the trainer, you know, they just be talking to you and stuff like that. So I actually started a six week program where I, um, you know, it pretty much take me from beginner, like a beginner runner to, you know, an actual runner and, um, like a runner where I can run for long distances and not get tired and things like that. 
but one of the things that he said and i'm so sorry for this light and it's just horrible right now but anyway y'all can hear me that's all that matter so one of the things that he said was he was like most he was like the only thing as bad as not being motivated is being overly motivated and what he meant by that was it's like he was he he actually said don't go into like a workout saying i'm gonna do this i'm gonna do that i'm gonna do this and i'm gonna do that and you know you can't do it like that's just like me saying okay i'm gonna go into the gym today and i'm gonna run five miles knowing that i can't even run one mile straight you know what i'm saying so it's like don't set unrealistic unrealistic goals because then once you get to the point where you can't do it it pretty much makes you like you know it just breaks your motivation altogether it breaks your drive so he was like set realistic expectations and realistic goals so that is something that really stuck with me not even just with working out just in general like it just stuck with me in general because that's something that i do all the time like i'll really be like oh today i'm gonna fold all the clothes in the house and watch them knowing damn well i don't like folding no clothes why, so why, why, why would i say that why would i say that so a more realistic goal would be i'm going to wash two loads and fold them that's a more realistic goal for me so yes so i want to start out with more realistic goals so anyway i said that i'm gonna go to the gym and i'm gonna really work on cardio i really want to work on getting my weight down um so i'm gonna i'm doing fasted cardio right now which means that you know i haven't eaten anything the only thing that i'm gonna take is my pre-workout which you all saw me make and i'm gonna drink me some water that's it i'm not gonna eat until after so yeah so for the month of you guys i'm really trying to transform my life i really also if this is your first time watching me i talk a lot you guys i talk a lot okay i talk a lot and um you know some people don't like that you know some people don't like that but it's just it's just it is what it is it's what i like you know what i'm saying i like to talk i like to sit and talk not necessarily to real people well y'all are real people I'm sorry, y'all are real people, but I'm just not talking to you right now. I'm talking to a camera. So, it's easier for me to, you know, that way. <laughs> but anyway, so I'm about to go to the gym. I don't even know what machine I'm going to do today because I really like the Stairmaster, you guys. But if you don't know, the Stairmaster is... That, that machine will humble you so quick. It'll humble you. You'll think that you... You'll think you're doing something. And then you get on that machine and that jet will humble you. So I don't even know if I want to get on that machine. I might just do the, I don't know what I'm going to do. I really don't, but I do want to get like an actual workout in and actually sweat and have a good workout. So that's what we're going to do. Anything else that I need to catch you all on? I know that down. <laughs> I think that's it. So yeah, I see you all. At the gym. Why is the light is so bad, you guys? Good gracious. It don't usually be like this. I don't know, y'all. I'm sorry about the lighting. Maybe it's where I'm at. I don't know. But we at the gym. I need to take my pre-workout right quick, quick. Y'all, what should I do? Should I do the stairmaster? Or should I do the elliptical or the treadmill? While I'm letting my pre-workout percolate, let me tell y'all. So I ordered this outfit from Pack. Well, actually, I ordered three items from Pack Sun. Three, y'all, right? Three items. Pay overnight shipping, which was twenty dollars. So I pay overnight shipping. Now, mind you, you guys, let me see when I order this. May the eleventh. What is today? June the first. Okay. So I ordered this May the eleventh for overnight shipping. Only one item came. That item total, like y'all, when I say it completely does not look like the item. I'm gonna show y'all when I get home. It doesn't. 
it looks nothing like what I ordered. Nothing. I don't know who, what, when, where, what. I don't know who adjusted. Like, the design is right, but the colors are completely off. And I'm like, okay. So, I called about that, and they told me, you know, I could send it back or whatever. But then the other two items, they still have not came, y'all. They, they have been stuck at the same location since May the 13th. I tried to reach out to them. You can't talk to nobody on the phone. You only can chat. So I chatted with somebody. They going, girl, they, I was about to say girl. <laughs> like, I'm really sitting here talking to my friend. Like, girl, girl, they did not have, they, um, they going to sit here and tell me, I have to give it seven to 10 business days. I said, even for overnight shipping, they say, yeah. I actually I had a good workout you guys exciting news also so the sauna is back open which I love that because I have not sat in the sauna you guys in over a year and on top of that I wasn't able to go to the gym as much because of the twins so when he, when their dad isn't um, here because of work he I can't go to the gym because I have the a matter of fact I need I should have asked them something but anyway I have the gym I have the daycare for the kids oh my gosh yo people be at Chick-fil-a like like they giving away chicken you know what I'm gonna door dash it I'm gonna door dash it I'm gonna door dash it right now so it'll be there when I get home anyway so the, the twins wasn't able to go to the gym because they weren't accepting kids under the age of one. So that was that. So I was like, Ugh, they can't go to the gym, which I really didn't even want them going to the gym anyway, honestly, because I would hate to fight somebody over my child, like for real. Um, so, and then when it comes to babies, like small babies, I just, uh -uh. three months now, and they said that they start into, they, they allow you to bring um, a child to the gym three months and older but if they're three months they only can be there for an hour you know and I'm still kind of hesitant because I'm like uh, you know this whole pandemic thing which it is getting better but I'm just like you know at what point will I feel comfortable because, you know, is it ever going to really fully 100% go away? So, I don't know. But that just gives me the opportunity to be able to go to the gym when he's not here. So, I like that. Okay, y'all. So, I'm, I'm making breakfast now. I'm going to go ahead and fix me an omelet. And I'm going to have me a everything bagel. These, you guys, are so so freaking good they're so good okay so these are the everything bagel it's a vegan um it's by the brand called odo's thins and i actually got this from wegmans but you can get it from like i assume it's sold in places like home whole food markets and stuff like that but it's so good but i have my two eggs turkey sausages and i'm gonna put some cheese in it i'm gonna make this bagel and i'm gonna also make me a smoothie so Let's get started. All right, so I'm done fixing my breakfast for the day. It does not look the best, but it tastes great so i'm gonna go ahead and eat i'm gonna go ahead and eat i have my smoothie and honestly you guys i have some work that i have to do today for my main job and i have some work that i need to do for youtube i have to um edit this video this um let me turn the camera around so y'all just not looking at the food i have to edit my clean with me video because that was supposed to go up sunday but i i was not able to record saturday which you all should have already saw in that video if you watched it 
I mean, not record. I wasn't able to finish it Saturday because the twins were driving me crazy. They just kept crying. Then Sunday, I was able to complete it, but I didn't get finished until like at like at night. So I was like, I I'm, I can't put this video up, video up Sunday, and then Monday, and then Monday was Memorial Day. So I'm gonna go ahead and get some work done, and I'll come back on later when I have something to, I guess show you guys <laughs> okay so it's about two o'clock now and i just took a shower and um did my little skincare routine for eczema which is coming soon you guys i'm recording a video because i've always wanted to do like a skincare routine video about like eczema and stuff like that well i wanted to do a skincare routine but i'm like I don't have flawless skin I have eczema like and you can see it like right here and right here so you know I'm gonna do a skincare routine to help other people with it because especially with it being summertime I know how it can like make you insecure to not even want to show your skin which how is how I felt for so long but I just now I'm just like I'm not gonna say I don't care I do care because I'm trying to correct it but I'm just not gonna hide you know what I'm saying I'm not going to hide try to hide it because it's just it is what it is but yeah I'm trying to get rid of this like this came after my pregnant well it just got worse it was coming like this was right here before like on my chin I had that bad before but I've been putting well I'm not gonna say what I've been putting up there because I want to do a routine about it anyway I have to have a meeting for work and then I'm going to try to go ahead and finish editing this video, um, the clean with me video, which I am dreading because, let me show y'all. Y'all see that? You see how long it is? Three hours and 39 minutes. So that means that I have to cut this video so much. Great. <laughs> but before I have my meeting, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, <clears throat> do my little Easton. What's this called? A diffuser, that's what it's called. I keep this bottle of water right here. I already drunk it, I just put some tap water in it. So I mix peppermint and I mix mint. <laughs> my neighbor dogs. <laughs> The only thing I don't like about these little things right here, it's like, I don't know, it just, it don't start coming out good until it's not filled all the way up. It say do like two to three drops, but that ain't enough for me. I want to smell it. Okay. y'all if you can hear that then you know what I'm laughing at is it coming out okay is it oh yeah it's coming out just gotta give it a little bit of time all right so I gotta meet y'all so I'll be back okay you guys so it's later in the evening I'm cooking dinner I'm making um, tacos for myself tonight. I'm making tacos for myself and I'm using ground turkey for the kiddos. And my man, I'm making nachos. And they use ground beef. All right, you guys, so this is my dinner for tonight. Three tacos. I used the almond flour tortillas from Siete, and I put some of their chipotle hot sauce on top, sour cream, shredded greens, and ground turkey. So, so I'm gonna go ahead and close out this vlog for today, you guys. The twins are on their way back from with their dad, and I need to make sure that their food is, well, his food is done. And then I also have to exercise again. Cause remember I say I'm doing two a days. So I know I'm not gonna feel like I'm back on camera. <laughs> 
So I'm gonna go ahead and eat before nine o'clock hit because I can't eat after nine. And yeah. So that's it. So I'll see you all tomorrow. I just got home from the gym. I'm about to make my coffee. Hold on, let me put some ice in my cup right quick. So, do I need ice? No, I don't need ice. I was about to put ice in my cup to make it look all cute or whatever. But yesterday, I tried to make iced coffee with my Keurig. I ain't like it. It just, I feel like the ice melted. Duh, it melted quick because I put it in hot coffee. I'm slow, but <laughs> I went to the store and I got this. This is the stock cold brew coffee, darker roll, still smooth, extra bold, unsweet. I got unsweet because I was looking at the little, the little nutrition facts, and this one has zero added sugars. They had another one, and the sugars was like. It was just too high for me. Like, you know, for me to be eating right. It was too high. So, I'm going to go ahead and make this. I also got the white chocolate mocha. And this it is by the brand. Who is this? Oh, International Delight. And this is zero sugar as well. So I feel like this is about to be nasty, y'all. As you saw, I just came back from the gym and I'm cooking my breakfast. I'm pretty much having the same thing that I'm having yesterday, just without the um the smoothie, the green smoothie. So I'm waiting for my omelet to finish. Hold on, I can put this. So I had an okay workout. I don't even know how much it is I'm supposed to pour. I'm gonna just pour it to what I think that you can be in coffee. It smells good. I had an okay workout. I was kind of almost being hard on myself, you guys, because I had such a hard time. I'm gonna see how that tastes. No sugar, you guys. No sugar. On today's agenda, I need to edit my video that's supposed to go up today. Most definitely. I need to edit that video like for real, for real. I was supposed to do some editing yesterday, y'all, but I was so freaking tired. I didn't even want to get up and go to the gym today. I'm sorry, I'm walking around without talking. <laughs> but I didn't even want to get up and go to the gym today, you guys. But my boyfriend, he was like, babe, he started, he came in the bed. He came and he woke me up and he was like, babe, he said, you said you wanted to be disciplined, which I did say for the month of June, my word is discipline. So he was like, get up. So I was supposed to get up at 530, but I didn't get up until six, which that's not too bad. I went to sleep late. I didn't go to sleep until after 11 so i didn't really want to get up too early because it's just as important to get enough sleep when you're trying to like lose weight and you know just get fit it's important to get enough sleep i'm always if you wonder why i'm looking over here y'all because the monitor is over here my canon i got a new camera my canon used to flip up this flips out so it's difficult but anyway let me taste this It's good. 
it's good. So if you're looking for a healthy coffee, get those two items. So I'm about to go upstairs because I have to edit. And we got the twins with us today. almost four hours later and I'm still editing this vlog but I was able to get it down from three hours to 36 minutes now I just let me turn it down now I just gotta um I said that I was gonna include like a mini house tour at the end because like you know I'm doing the clean with me but even though I'm doing that you really can't you know see the full picture so I'm just gonna do a mini clean with me so I hope y'all watch my sh I hope y'all watched it. <laughs> hey you guys, good morning. My battery is already blinking red, which I something told me to bring my um, charge battery, but I did not listen. I don't know why I don't listen to my brain sometimes. But good morning. I did not close out the vlog yesterday because I was so, first of all, I was tired. I was cramping. The cramps was kicking my tail. So they won me over. And I just, I just was ready to go to sleep. I didn't even exercise last night like I was supposed to. So, and I didn't upload my video yesterday because I still have to film like the mini tour of the house and I didn't film that, so whatever. Anyway, um, I'm on my way to the gym. I'm not gonna film any gym footage today because how many times do y'all? <laughs> need to see it um my sister came and got Kaylani yesterday which I was so grateful for because you know even though I still have Khalil it's like when she takes one of them it helps it helps it's so much easier to move from one child than two so when she does take them I'm so grateful so we'll take you know usually she only takes one of them unless I have to go to an appointment or something sometimes she'll like um keep both of them if they can't stay with their dad i just got back from the gym y'all unfortunately my camera died in the last clip in the middle of me talking but mr khalil mr khalil did so good in a daycare yeah yes papa yes <laughs> he did so good i took his clothes off because it's a little warm in here Oh wait, hold on y'all. I took his clothes off because it's a little warm in here and I'm about to wrap him up after I change his pamper and feed him. Um, that workout was eh. It was like I tried a new machine and the machine is just like, I couldn't really like get a good rhythm, I'll say that. So then I got off that and I got on the treadmill. So that was an okay workout. I only could work out for an hour and I wouldn't even consider the whole hour because I sit in the sauna in the beginning. So they only allow three month olds to be in there for an hour. So it was an okay workout, but I'm definitely gonna work out here at home again. And I'm gonna do the treadmill again tonight but um i really don't have anything going on today you guys like for real for real i have to upload my video today i have to just i already cleaned up so i have to like just freshen you know the dishes you know just freshen up um so it won't get out of hand and film the mini tour of the house and yeah that's pretty much it this weekend will be a little bit more event eventful i have to i'm going to get my nails done tomorrow y'all i'm getting my nails done tomorrow and i have a couple of different options i have a couple of different options of how i want to get my nails so hear me out y'all right quick right quick so i'm looking at my phone if you wonder what i'm looking at so 
like colorful nails. Like I like experimenting with my nails. Sometimes I get something that's, you know, like simple and stuff like that. But I just like playing with, you know, that's how I express myself. I like to do different designs. So that's what I was going to do. I was thinking about doing, um, I saw this. Okay, yeah. So I saw this online. So I wanted to do this. But then I'm like, mm, I don't know. I might still do it. <laughs> I don't know. But then I have to film a, a skincare routine, how I do my like body routine for um, eczema. And I just feel like since it's going to be like close up on my hands, I feel like it just will be a more aesthetically pleasing look. Something like this. So I don't know you guys. I really do not know. But then I also was gonna do this. But I said that's just a little bit too simple for me. But yeah, so I just gotta figure out. So that appointment is early in the morning. But being that it's just me and Khalil tonight today, I feel like I can get some work done. I'm about to fix my breakfast, which <sighs> y'all. Let me tell y'all. Hold on, let me let me come over here. This this is the moment where I'm about to be talking, y'all. Okay, this can't. I, I'm about, I should put something on the screen that say "cancer moment loading." Okay, because I be having a lot of cancer moments. I like to be, you know, I like to play and stuff like that, but I like to talk. Um, bruh, why like? We already got to deal with periods. This is not what I was about to talk about, but I'm just thinking about it because it's like got me feeling drained. We already have to deal with periods. Why in the heck do we have to deal with cramps? <laughs> I feel like my uterus is fighting. Like, what are you doing? Oh my God. Oh, I need to drink my, okay, so I'm about to drink my protein drink. I'm trying to stay on top of this stuff, you guys. Anyway. So I was sitting in the um I was sitting in the sauna and this girl I had my headphones in or whatever it was four girls in there and one of the girls said something and she just I, and I was like I didn't hear her so she was like I just love the fact that it's four black girls in here um you know and like we're at the gym trying to get our body right which you know that's something that I love I like I honestly you guys when I go to the gym I don't see a lot of black females in there that has like a banging shape or a banging body or something like that and I feel like in the world of social media when we go online we see these girls with always look pretty nice body you know what I'm saying like and that's what it makes us believe that that's like we're missing out or something or we are not like our body isn't you know like we 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 just don't look good because that's what we see but when you really go out unless you live somewhere where that's common like maybe georgia or atlanta or something like that but where i live at hold on let me move the camera but where i live at that is not common like i rarely go out and see somebody in you know what's crazy? I just did this same thing yesterday. Have you ever did that? You should, uh. Uh. I'm stupid. So it just made me really be like, like I just need to be, because I have been disciplined this week, but this week, like I, it's not hard for me to be disciplined you know, for a couple of days, it's hard for me to continuously be disciplined. And, you know, that's what I really want to change for myself because it's like, you know, what's stopping you? Like, what, you are the only one that's stopping you from getting the body that you want and for you to be healthy and things like that. That is only you, which I'm talking to myself, is, you know, it's only me. And, you know, I be craving stuff like Jersey Mike's. You know, stuff that's not healthy and it's like, where they going? 
you know and it's like i really have to program myself to not even like have that stuff so then eventually i just won't even want it but in my mind right now like right now like i really want a good breakfast which consists of pancakes eggs bacon you know that's what i want and i just can't do that right now and um you know so yeah i'm trying to be disciplined and not just with working out just all around i'm just trying to be disciplined because I just feel like if I could be disciplined with one thing, then I could be disciplined with another, then I could be disciplined with another thing. And like being able to control my mind to where even if I want something to not do it, you know, I feel like that it would help out so much all around, you know? So anyway, today on the agenda, like I already said, I really have to just freshen up in the house and I need to film the mini tour just me and Khalil until later on, until like around six o'clock. So it's 11 o'clock right now. So I have time. I didn't even give y'all an update on my PacSun, y'all. So I reached out to PacSun. They gonna say that my order was lost in transit. Y'all didn't know it was lost last week when I tried to reach out to y'all. Y'all told me I had to wait till June. I'm about to cook breakfast for lunch today. I am going to, I'm, I'm saying that out loud so I can tell myself. I'm going to make me a turkey burger and I'm, I'm going to either do sweet potato fries or broccoli and I'll probably eat the same as that thing for dinner. I do have some Ezekiel bread, but I'm not even going to eat it on the Ezekiel bread. I'm going to just do the turkey burger. That's it. Okay, y'all. So it's a little bit later. As you can see, I still got the same shirt on because... I haven't even taken a shower yet, and I'm not changing my clothes until I actually get a shower. I haven't taken a shower yet because I'm like, I want to exercise again. So then I'm going to have to like, that would be like, I might as well just wait. But I'm cooking my turkey burger, like I said earlier. And my hands are super ashy, you guys. But guess what? If, if you ever see my hands ashy, just know ashy. Just know they're ashy because I wash my hands. I just need to start keeping some lotion around. Anyway, I'm gonna season my turkey burger with, I'm gonna season my turkey burger with this. This is the Tina Lee, the original spice mix. When I tell y'all this is so good, my sister put me on to this. And literally, it, it tastes good with anything. 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 <laughs> But I already finished filming my um the tour of the house or whatever. Y'all, I promise I'm gonna get cute tomorrow. I'm gonna get cute tomorrow. I kinda wanna take my hair out, honestly. I wanna take my hair out, but mm, but I wanted to wear my wig Saturday. So I might as well just keep my braids in. Cause that's why I always have a scarf on or a hat because I be having my wig braids in. But I wanted to wash my hair and like just wear my hair out. But I'm not gonna do that because me and my boo be going on a date Saturday. So I wanna look real cute, you know what I'm saying? Good morning, you guys. I'm on my way to my nail appointment and look at this rain. Oh my gosh. Hey, you guys. Sorry for the shaking. I don't know why it's doing all this shaking right now. But anyway, happy Friday. I haven't even came on camera. Well, I did have a little clip earlier, but I haven't came on camera camera yet. But happy Friday. You guys, I did not end out that vlog last night because when I tell you I wanted to stab myself in the stomach that's how i felt i was cramping so bad that i couldn't even think straight that's how bad i was cramping but i am on my way to the gym now and i know i've been looking a mess on camera literally all week okay i have not looked like a thing all week but um i'm on my way to the gym right now and then later on we are going on a date which i'm excited about because we have not been on a date 
since honestly i want to say we have not been on a date like just me and him since the twins have been born i want to say um the only thing i did today was i went to get my nails done can you see kind of it's like a gold ombre tip so yeah and i'm on my way to the movies now i mean to the gym Y'all, let me tell y'all. You know they say it's supposed to be Mer Mercury rec retrograde right now, y'all. I don't know what's been going on, but it's been some weird stuff going on. Let me tell y'all. First of all, yesterday, which this part don't even have nothing to do with Mercury Mercury retrograde, but it's just been some weird stuff going on with me. Yesterday, I ordered a pizza, right? No, I was not supposed to be eating a pizza. That's why I probably happened. I ordered a pizza. I requested pepperoni. They only gave me cheese, which I was so mad about because I'm like, do I look like a child? I wanted me some pepperoni. <laughs> um, so that happened. And then this morning when I was going to get gas, I pulled the gas thing out of the nozzle. Y'all, gas went everywhere. So still right now my gas is my, my car is smelling like gas in the inside because it just literally went everywhere. Then when I got home, I ordered a tropical smoothie. I ordered a tropical smoothie, so I ordered a smoothie and a wrap. I'm in the car. I mean, I'm standing in the doorway and this lady walking up with just a wrap. So I'm like, um, <laughs> did you get the smoothie? And she was like, they didn't give me no smoothie. And she was like, I'm so sorry. They didn't give me a smoothie. So I had to say that I didn't get a smoothie, which they gave me a credit back, which I don't even like that they didn't even give me an option to get a refund because they only gave me a freaking credit. And I'm like, that's still putting, well, I, it really ain't DoorDash fault. It's her fault because I ha, I've done DoorDash before. So when you do DoorDash, you have to select that you pick those items up. She didn't pick up my smoothie. So... I was hot about that y'all then i'm eating the wrap y'all you would think i selected extra lettuce as much lettuce they gave me in that wrap and then not only that it had all this lettuce and it had a nerve for the lettuce to be old lettuce so I'm just like, this is just getting on my damn. I was irritated at that point, but my boyfriend made a reservation for us to go eat tonight. He won't tell me where, but y'all, I already know it's at Peter Chang's. Watch I tell you that it's at, watch, 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 watch. Between me and you, just me and you, nobody else. Watch we be at Peter Chang's later on. Watch. He, my boyfriend is so predictable. Like he is just, he's just predictable. <laughs> and he think he not but you can't get nothing past me i'm a cancer baby you guys we're finally out for date night hopefully we can enjoy ourselves because kaylani was i don't know what's going on with her but it's just like every time single time we would put her down she would cry and she don't want you to, she don't even like even if you're holding her she don't want you to hold her in like the cradle position only upright so hopefully his god sister is watching her so hopefully you know she doesn't give her such a hard time so we can enjoy our i believe this is our like i said i think this is our first time out eating since the twins have been here this as far as like eating by ourselves so i was really looking forward to that let me just turn the brightness down a little but yeah so we're about to go eat now, I'm, I wanted to really get a picture, but I'm not satisfied with how I look because I wasn't able to do anything with my wig. I just threw the joint on, like it ain't even secured. I ain't, you know what I'm saying? Like I wasn't able to do, I wanted to put like some um, like beach wave curls in it, but I wasn't able to do anything because of time. I would have, I did start getting ready in a good amount of time, however, the twins were crying and I decided to get them a bath to calm them down. So, mom life. Do you guys see the sky? It is so pretty. 
I love sunsets, you guys. Hey, how you doing? Good. Can I get y'all something to eat? Yes. Um, can I have the I will food? I think it's called the hand crafted one. Oh, the crab wonton. Yes, the crab wonton. Okay. And for my entree, I would like to have the um, king spicy chicken. King spicy chicken with no green onion. And it's something else they come in it. Ginger, I think. Um, no, it's not ginger onion. It's just green onions and. Onions that are diced up in there, and then it's, it's just like a mix in the sauce. Chili paste. Okay. There so is ginger in there. It's ginger, chili paste, and green onions. Do they have four you can do no ginger? Mm hmm Okay, so can I get no ginger and no green onions? Yeah. And I would like extra sauce. Mm -hmm. And that's it. Mm -hmm. All right, what can I get for you? We got a vegetable spring roll, uh, yeah, spring rolls, and a uh, spicy meat, so ramen, with noise, and chicken. Okay. And it's all ramen with chicken. You said no egg? No, no onion. No onion. They come with egg? No, but you yeah. get egg. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Did you want a spice bomb or anything? Uh, what does that do for spice bomb? It's just like spice. It's, it adds flavor. Okay, yeah, I get it. The spice bomb. All right. So I have, hold on, I'm gonna read this back to y'all. I have crab wontons, uh, veggie spring rolls, uh, chain chicken, no onions, no ginger. I have uh, miso ramen, uh, add chicken with a spice bomb. And no onions. Right. All right, I'll go put this in for y'all. All right, thank you. About time after waiting for almost 30 minutes. Well, the food is here, and Babe is completely not satisfied with his food. <laughs> he didn't like that over there, which is the veggie spring rolls. And then, <laughs> I don't know why you <laughs> This is what my fortune cookie said. What you say, babe? <laughs> what did I say? Your curiosity will lead you to the answer you seek. Ooh. <laughs> okay, I'm about to watch your number that. My lucky number that. Is that out there? I don't know. Uh, Kobe made everybody know. cheat. Huh? I said Kobe made everybody cheat. You don't want to put numbers on the back. <laughs> Happy Saturday, you guys. So I just left from getting my eyebrows done. I didn't film it, of course. I be feeling so weird filming like, I don't know. I'm, I'm just, I'm still adjusting because, you know, I don't want to invade anybody. Personal, you know, space or whatever. But I just got my eyebrows done, y'all. I go get them threaded. When I tell y'all, hold on, I'm driving, so. And I didn't put, prop it up this time because I'm about to get out of the car. Matter of fact, I need to see what time Hobby Lobby opens. When I tell y'all getting them threaded hurt so bad, like, some people say it don't hurt, but it just hurt me, y'all. Like, it just hurts me, for real. Mm, ooh, 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 ooh. Sorry, my phone died. I think that 
this one is cute just to like put up there you know old snap can see obviously and time to get some Starbucks now I just gotta figure out where one is oh yeah this is the line dang don't forget to pick up oh you know what I want honestly you guys I want me some Bravos is Bravos open I wonder if they do curbside pickup Thank you for calling Bravo Italian Kitchen. For reservations, press 1. For pickup or curbside, press 2. Period. For What's up, brother? Wait, how may I help you today? Hi, can I have a caramel ribbon crunch in the size venti? You caramel ribbon crunch in the today? Yes. Can I have extra caramel and extra ribbon crunch, please? Extra caramel, extra crunch. Okay, any tree? No, that is all. 641 for you. Thank you. I felt like a bug was crawling on my damn lip. Okay, you guys. So it's later now. Round two of date night with me and my future husband. <laughs> you better have said yep. Tell them wait. It is too bright. I look light sky. Hmm? Oh, I'm sorry, babe. Um, I tried to record a reel, you guys, and it was an epic fail. <laughs> like, it was an epic fail, so I don't know. I'm trying to do a reel a day, so we're going to have to see how that go. But I just have on a black shirt and some, some camo pants. Don't mind the... Yeah, the format <laughs> and my ones. Oh my gosh. Oh. The traffic is backed up, so let's hope we make it in time because. We're not. It's as clear as I've done that. We're not in time. What? We don't need that negativity. I'm just saying, so I start 7 15 and 6 59. You guys, we just left the movies and the movie was good. Um, I do recommend if you've seen the first one, I recommend seeing the second one. Hopefully, they come out with a third one. I think they are based upon how it ended, but the movie was good. We enjoyed our date night. The food was good. Would you, well, you say your food was good, right? Your, the bur your chicken soup? Oh, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. The the had wings. Oh, yeah, that was the only thing. He usually get wings and they didn't have wings, they only had bullets. He doesn't like bullets. So other than that, the food was good, the movie was good, everything was good. So now we're about to go home. Honestly, I'm tired, so I'm going to sleep. And I'm going to go ahead and end this vlog right here. So I can go ahead and edit it tomorrow and have it uploaded. So thank you for watching, you guys. Don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you all in my next weekly vlog. Bye.